Are you looking to start your own business? Millions of brothers have turned to eBay to escape the rat race. Become your own boss and get the Power Seller Research eBook. It's a comprehensive, step-by-step -step guide that explains how to start an eBay business. The website is PowerSellerResearch.com. Again, that's PowerSellerResearch.com. Thank you for tuning in. Thanks for being part of our program. We appreciate it. Here we are together again on the radio. Now, you have heard me on this program many times tell the guys the following phrase. Dump that bitch. There's any number of reasons why we tell guys to do this. And every once in a while, a guy gets up the balls, he gets up the courage to come on the air with me and dump that bitch. And the unsuspecting bitch doesn't know what she's about to get. Now, we're going to talk to Nancy coming up in a little while. She has no idea what Edgar has in store for her. Now, Edgar, you had a great life, didn't you? Yeah. Tell me about well, it. Um, I thought it was good. We, you know, we have money. We have two kids, two beautiful kids. Just one, one night, she went out with her friends and uh, supposedly for a, a company dinner date. And that night, I woke up to go get a glass of water. And oh, our computer is in the living room. She went and go. To, she went to uh, use the restroom. And I, you know, glanced at the computer and um, she was typing to somebody. Somebody was typing back. And it said that it was a guy. He said that he had a wonderful time at the movies that night. So I asked her, you know, what is going on? And she says, oh, it's just uh, play. They're, they're playing. She's playing with the guy's head. I really don't think so because I, she told me three days ago that she was going to go out. She was going to go to a, a meeting with her company. And I called her during the time she told me she was going to go. And um, they told me that she was gone for the day, that there was no meeting that day. So I know something's going on, and um, I've been listening to previous um, shows that you've had, and I just got the courage to, um, like you say, dump that bitch. Now, you didn't get the hardcore evidence that she asked somebody else, but you're pretty certain that that's what's going on. Um, I have a gut feeling, and when you have a gut feeling, I mean... I don't know. I don't want to be dipping my stick in 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 a, a you know a, a dirty hole. I understand. If you know what I mean. I know exactly what you mean. So you're gonna dump that bitch. Her name is Nancy. Yep. Uh, are you ready to do this? Yep. I got the courage. I'm a little nervous, but I'm gonna do it. All right, Edgar. We got Nancy on the phone. Are you ready? Yep. All right. Here we go. Let's do it. All right, this is Nancy. Hi, Nancy. Hello. How's it going? All right. Good. Say hi to Edgar. Hello. Hello, honey. Do you know you're on the air? I, 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 Dean told you you're on the air, right? Yes. Good. Okay, cool. And we got Edgar. Edgar Edgar gave us your phone number. Say hi to Edgar. Hello. Hi, honey. Hello. What is Are this you, about? You know, I'm so, just, you get off at 7, right? Yes, we should be getting out anytime soon, as soon as I'm done with my phone call. And uh, I'm just uh, letting you know that I'm not picking you up today from work. You're going to take the bus home. How about that? What? What do you mean I'm taking the bus home? Yeah, you're going to take the bus home. You're, I'm going to... You know who Tom Likas is, right? You know I've been listening for about four or five months, and you don't like him? Right. And he has right. a phrase. He has a phrase that he uses with um with the collars. Uh-huh. Which is? I'm going to dump that bitch today. You're going to dump what? <laughs> You're kidding me, right? No. They said I... Um, I think you're cheating, and that the talk that we had that that night that I read that email, um, it's kind of you're funny. You're still, you're still, oh my god. Okay, you're you're still tripping about the email. What happened with that email, Nancy? 
Okay, I don't know who emailed me, but I emailed them back, and... How, how, are you gonna, that, how are you not going to know who emailed you? Who's going to get your email address? Anybody. Anybody on the computer. What do you mean who's going to get my email address? Who emails you with, with sextoys.com or whatever? How do they get your email address? What did the person say to you in the email, Nancy? It said, uh, email me Let back. me tell you what it said, Tom. It said that he had a great, a great night at the movies, the night that she said she was going to go out with her friends. For dinner. I even not. let her out. I even let her go out with her friends to eat dinner. What's the point of you calling me to with the Tom Nike show? Why couldn't you have called me? Oh, why couldn't you have told me this in person? Yeah, well, Nancy, did you go out with that guy? No, I didn't go out with any guy. But uh, why would a guy write to you and say he was at the movies with you last night? I don't know who he was emailing to. I emailed, if he would have read what I emailed him back, I emailed, I think you have the wrong person, and that's it. Now, now, did you tell Edgar one day that you were going to be at a meeting and you were going to be home late? Because I go of... to meetings because of my work all the time. Edgar, what happened when she told you that she was going to a meeting? I called your work and they, they said that you were gone for the day. If you have yeah, a meeting, because you have, I was at the meeting. A meeting in your office. You know very well that when I go to the meetings, we go to dinner meetings, okay? You know oh, very yeah. well that they're dinner not here at the clinic. All the, yeah, all the dinner time. meetings. Yeah, dinner meetings. And where are you playing the part anyway? How about all the other times that you go out with your friends? Well, what about that? Well, we'll get to that in a minute. But uh, now, Edgar, you told me that when you called the office, it wasn't just that Nancy wasn't in the office. You spoke to someone at the office. Who did you speak to? I spoke to one of the workers there. And they told you that there was no meeting? They told me, they, that's exactly what they told me. They told me that there was no meeting, that you were gone for the day. Well, that all depends on who you spoke to. And that was, if that you was spoke three to days somebody, ago. If you that was spoke three days to... ago. I, didn't, I, I let it go. I, I let it go, and I didn't, I didn't tell you anything about it because I don't want to fight anymore. Why not? Maybe if you would have asked me, I would have told you what, you know, what happened. Maybe you could have... Well, then why didn't you tell me when you got home? Tell you what? I was at a meeting. I didn't say anything because I told you I was going to a meeting. I went to the meeting and I came home, and that's it. So, Nancy, you're saying you've never flirted with other guys, never gone out for a drink with other guys, never I'm gone. I'm not say I never flirted with other guys. Uh -huh. the same why, 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 would with write, guys? why would somebody write that I had a great time at the movies? With, I don't know with, who they with, with your screen name. They could have mailed. They could have had the wrong email. I mean, did you read the email that I that I that I sent back? Did yeah, you turn you turned off the did computer. Did you turn off the computer? You did turned you why did you turn off the computer? Because I was dead. Because why? Well, yeah, you were dead because dead. I was there. Well, I'll tell you what, Ed, we could, we, we, I'll tell you what, we could find out the truth. Why don't you have Edgar write to this person and pretend to be you sure, why and not? set up a meeting? Okay, I and, can do that. All right, do you, know, do you have that uh, email? Do you have the email address of that person? No, it was a one-time thing. I forgot oh. the name of the email. Oh, now, now it's a one-time thing. Now it, it wasn't a, a, a mistake, right? Oh, what? Is this on America Online? Or what, what kind of online service are we talking about here? It's AOL. AOL. It's AOL. Well, if you go to AOL, they have all of the mail you've deleted. So, Edgar, you, you got her password? You could log on right now and get that email back. I don't, I, I don't have her password. Why don't you give him your password, Nancy, and then Edgar can get on and pretend to be you. And uh, obviously, if he gets on and pretends to be you and writes to that person, Edgar could set up a meeting with that person and then meet him in person, and then uh, he'll know that it's a fake. I'll do you one better, Tom. If he has to go through all of that, then what's the, what's the point? Because, well, and Nancy, he's got you against the wall. Come on, admit it. You, you, you've been cheating on him. Come on. I have not been cheating Come on him. Come clean with him. Don't, why do you embarrass yourself anything. this way? It's so My obvious. My email doesn't say anything. Why don't you just let him write back to that person and then uh, see if the person responds? You know what? We're not even going to yeah, bother with that. We're not going to bother with that. You, you, today, tonight... You go to your mom's house. Okay, why don't we do this? Up, pick up your stuff. Get them and you don't need to pick it up. I'll drop it at your mom's house. I don't want you. I don't want you. I'm not cheating on you. Maybe I am cheating on you. Because I pay the rent. You are cheating on it. Maybe I am. Why, why wouldn't I? Why don't you just oh, no. admit it right now? I mean, come clean with him. You know, why, why drag this out? He's already on you. Why would he be surprised? But, but the point is. Why would he be surprised? Why don't you cop to him? Why don't you tell him how bad you're in bed? Why don't you tell him all of that? All right, so now, now you're telling us why you're cheating on him. So, so just admit to him you've been cheating. Look, I haven't been cheating, but if I wanted to, well, you did go to the movies with that cheating. guy, and it's I so did obvious. I not go to any movies with that guy, but if he's gonna, if he's gonna get on on the air and tell the whole world that he's cheating on me and try to look like I'm not well, picking you, you up from work, he's taking the bus. I mean, yeah, right. right. 
Whatever. And you're, why, why, do you, why do you say, if he's lousy in bed, why didn't you get, do something about it? I'm dropping, I, off all your, I'm dropping off all your... You don't crap. have to drop anything off. I, have, I, I can buy everything new. Don't worry about it. Throw it all yeah, away. Nothing, I wouldn't want to have anything that reminds well, yeah, me about you anyway. Right? I give you everything. You take everything from me, right? Yeah, no, I have what? Taken what? Taken what? So, you, you so wait a minute, Nancy. So what you're saying is you got it elsewhere because he's not giving yeah, it to you at home, he's right? He's not giving it up. No, that's yeah, that's right. So that's why you went out and got it somewhere. What do you mean I had a great night? But you did go out and I get it somewhere. I had a great night. Yes, and I had a great well, night. Tell that tell that girl who it was. I'm not going to tell him who it was. It's none of his business. But you did do that. You did, Chief. You did. What if I did? Uh, were you Were you thinking about? Well, I mean, what's the point? Of, what's the point of keeping up the charade? Just tell are them. Are you thinking about your two girls when you when you were doing that? Thinking about my what? Your two girls, yeah. Oh, you forgot about them. You right? love that. You love that. And now I you're gonna what? complain. Love now what? Now you're gonna complain. My two girls. Yeah. My two were girls. What about What about my two girls? He wants to know if you were thinking about them while you were effing this other guy. He wants to know if you were thinking about your girl. Oh, I was when, thinking about how horrible he was. How horrible he was. When I was asking this and where, guy. Where did you meet this you, guy? You, you, you never complain to me. Whatever. I just don't say anything that's different. I mean, if he was that lousy in bed and you had to get him somewhere else, why didn't you just tell him? Because I didn't want to hurt his male ego. I didn't want him to think that he was that bad in bed and, you know, then he's going to get all mopey. I see, but uh, the point is he's not going to stay with you if you're having sex with other guys. And I'm not because I'm dumping that bitch, Tom. I'm doing oh, it today. That's it. Yeah, you're 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 real big in bed. So real that, big in bed. Not, I, wait, wait a minute. If if he was lousy in bed, why didn't you like try to make it better? Why didn't you tell it? Because I see no point, Tom. We've been There's together no for three years, and it's been so the same. He doesn't same know how to do it. That's thing. it. We've been married for three years, and it's been so the same. So you, you, it was over. a big mystery. You were never going to tell him what he could do better, or how he could improve, or anything. If that was I might case. have after I, after I was done with the other one. The other I might have. Now, yeah. did you meet the other one at work? Where did you meet him? Online? No. No, I... Yeah, online. You met him online? Yeah. In a chat room? Yeah. And uh, how long has it been yeah, going that's on? You, that's why you go to sleep late, huh? <laughs> that is why she goes to sleep late. Hey, Edgar, now she's yeah. telling you the truth. Let's let her tell the truth. All right, so how long has it been going on, Nancy? When I went out for the meeting, that was the first time. That was the first time? Yeah, but how long yeah. have you been talking to him? What, three, four months? Five months? Six months? A year? Two years? A month. A month, okay. And uh, so you went to the movies with him, or you went somewhere else? Uh, both. You went to the movies, and then you went where? To his place? No, to a hotel. To a hotel. And how was he? Great, Tom. He was? Great. You have no idea. Tell us what he would do that Edgar wouldn't do. Well, let's see. He's... He tried every style I like. He, uh... Like what? What do you like? Well, see, Tom, Edgar's boring. Edgar's... What do you mean I'm boring? How, how am I boring? You're boring. You're boring. How am I boring? You're boring. Missionary position is the only position there is out there. Maybe you should get into some, some chat rooms and talk to somebody and see what they teach you. Maybe you should try that. So you learned all about this in chat rooms. Like you found out there was a whole big world out there and you weren't getting any of it. No, I knew it was a whole big world out there. Just you know what that, I'm talking but I wasn't about. getting it. And so when Maybe you should try that, and then we can get back together and see how it is after that. So you how about if you stay by yourself? How about that? That's fine. That's fine. You can keep being boring on your own. So you went to a hotel, and this guy did every style you like, Nancy? Yeah, every way. Tell us everything he did. no idea. Tell, I want Edgar to hear what what he did. Tell him. No, I don't, I'm not... Come on, we've gone this far. Edgar needs to know. Hey, you know what? He won't make the same mistakes again if you tell him what the other guy did. Okay, how about we call my hair? I'm make the same How about? How about you go down on me? How about you pull my hair? How about you you grab me how like about, you don't want to do it? Cause you're out. out. How about that? Let him do okay, it. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. If that's what you want, and if you thought getting on on Tom like this was gonna make it uh, easier for you, then that's fine. That's fine. If that's what you want, okay. Edgar, you never pulled Nancy's hair. <laughs> Not the one I'm. Hell, hell, I'd have pulled her hair. 
Hell, I'd, spank, I, I'd not pull her hair. I'd spank her ass while I was doing the spanking, Nancy. He doesn't. He doesn't try, like to try yeah, anything. I mean, the guy in the hotel, did he spank oh, her? Yeah. Hard? Yes. And he pulled your hair and said, so he like, like, like riding a horse, you know, pulling your hair and spanking at the same time? Yeah, exactly. Oh, yeah. All right. Th- all right. Yeah, so why don't we try that? Why don't we try that? Why don't, you, why don't you admit that, that maybe me cheating on you was just a little bit your fault? Because oh, I yeah, yeah, it's all my fault. It's no, I didn't say fault. it's all your fault. I didn't say it's yeah. all your fault. I yeah, said maybe whatever. try something different once in a while and maybe, you know, admit that, that you're boring. How about you boring? I'm outside. How about you check if I'm outside? Hey, Nancy, did you ever tell Edgar what yeah. you liked? Did you ever tell him to pull your hair or give you a good spanky there? Tom, I did I did that, in the but... beginning, Tom. I did in the beginning. I told him that I liked... This and that, and I told him that, that, you know, we should try something different, and he just never tried it. He thought because we were married and, and, and it wasn't, you know what, you're, not you're the just, way it's supposed to be. You're just a slut. That's what, that's what you are. I'm a what? You're a slut. Yeah, and you're boring. Slut? You're boring. You're, you're, you're terrible in bed. I hope, I hope if we, if we do break up that you don't end up with someone else. No, 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 no. It's not before. if we do. It's not if we do. We all well, are I hope you don't go and bore someone else's sex life. Whatever. I hope, I, I hope Whatever. you you learn a, a few things and. Uh, why, why don't you check some outside? Now, Nancy. I don't know what to do. Take the bus home. I hope you're not. Now, Nancy, this guy is spanked in the hotel. Are you going to see him again? After today, yeah. Yeah, you're going for it. Yep. Yep. Just yep. like the slut and the whore you, that you are. Yeah, well, maybe I wouldn't be a slut. Maybe I'd be a whore and a slut to you if you didn't think about what they're going to learn. They're not gonna learn anything. They don't. They don't have to uh, know anything. Oh, uh, I'll have a little, a little, uh, 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 little pit night tales. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell them. Yeah, well, I hope well, they don't end up. When they ask you, when they ask you that, why aren't the parents together? You tell them, okay? Yeah, I'm gonna tell them. When when they get old enough, to text and they're married, I'm gonna tell them that if their husband is as boring as you. Are you looking to start your own business? Millions of brothers have turned to eBay to escape the rat race. Become your own boss and get the Power Seller Research eBook. It's a comprehensive, step-by-step guide that explains how to start an eBay business. The website is PowerSellerResearch.com. Again, that's PowerSellerResearch.com.